coming road. Mountain coming road. Problem coming. Whoa. Hero see a way. Hero see a way. Problem coming road. Problem. Listen. And when I reach the sea of for Oh, 
parts well Though the billows dash and sway ourselves on being the best, we offer affordable, reliable care on the beautiful island of Jamaica where you become a part of our family. With us, you have enough for your care. Here, your dollars multiply. Call or email us for more details. See you soon. Yo, get your straight. You know, it's a quote in this, a.k.a. Scantily Babas. Along with me, I drink them. Star King, I agree. Presents Train on One Earth Day celebration. You know, the 30th of the month called March. You know, right at Poppy, you know, at Tavon Day. You know, right at the community center. Music by DJ Platinum, DJ Kelly, One Sky Views. You know, there's some come down one, the one they're wicked, the one they're a bad, you know, some come in. Admission free. Add it up now. A blessed g- good evening, Jamaica. A uh, blessed evening to the members of the diaspora. A blessed evening to everyone near and far. I am back. Two days of, how would I put it? Two days of activities. Yeah, man. Not because I've not been around means that I've been not doing anything. Yesterday I was in England. I was in London with Isaac Buchanan. You only never see me in London yesterday. I just ran off the plane. I just come off the plane. Yeah, man. Just land. And I'm back here, cool, calm, and collective. Who miss me? Courtney, I miss me. You did miss me? You did sick, but we miss you. No, sir, you don't miss me, Courtney. Who miss me? You miss you, Wednesday? Producer, you did miss me. <coughs> Producer, you never miss me. The artist show never there on two days straight. Jimmy, hey, the mountain message. The mountain message come in. Are you okay, people? Things say something wrong with me. But I did say to me, say I was going to be missing for two days. And you never remember I said to you. What me get a message today? The person say, Hello, Professor. Are you coming on tonight or not? I need to know now before I go on the road. So, Mr. What do you mean by that? Woman say if she, she needs to know, she needs to go up on about two hours that you know. She needs to know she needs to go up on the road or to sit down and stay for class. So I said to her that I'll be on tonight. 
At one point, I had to lock off my phone, you know, man. The amount of calls and support. Sometimes I wonder, what do we do when I'm not around? No, sir. Is who this I call me so early? This a woman I love call at the beginning. I Hello. I miss you, man. I miss you, Andre. I miss you. So what do you do for the two night then? Well, I don't know. I don't listen nothing. I listen. I don't listen. You never do nothing? Miss, miss Andre, bad man. Oh. I saw you miss me? Yeah, man. Mm-mm. I can understand, but me the back on tonight, all right? Yeah, okay. Mm. Yeah, I never know, said this is the impact I have on the nation. If I don't come, imagine if them not see me for all one, two weeks. Hey! If them not see me for one, two weeks, they're mad. Unu mad, don't it? Somebody said them sleep. I will put never strong on a well I come in every day, I know. Kind of fun who loves triangle about places. Hello, good night. Good night. Yes, good night. Uh, my first time calling Andrea, when you're not on, me not tell that. Mm -hmm. When you're not on, yes. I'm telling the truth. And my first time calling this is Angie Angel. Yes. And I'm calling from outside of Toronto. Mm -hmm. And may I tell you, my heart hurt me. Your heart hurt you when you not get me? Yeah, when I not see on my YouTube, me, me, me can't do it. Oh. So you need to come on. You need to come on. All right. I'm here now. Go on, go on back in the class. Me in the class. Okay. Mm -hmm. Love you. Bye. Yes, my dear. Uh, at her time. So students, we have some matters of national importance that I, everything is of national importance. But I have to say this tonight that there are some missing young girls. About three missing young girls. Who is calling me now? Hello? Hi, Andrew. Yes? So it's oh god, but I say that I was not going to be on. No, so I'm never here, boy. I'm not telling I really miss it for the school night, you know. Maybe I got they are search. Mm -mm. <laughs> no. All right. I'm here now, all right? Yeah, man, big up yourself, yeah? All right. Yeah, man. Yeah, hello. Yeah. Yes, you know what, sir? Big man thing. Yes. If you're not coming at night time and everything, you know the whole place is dead. Not tell you straight forward. Oh, Jesus. The whole place is dead. Mm -mm. If you're not coming at night time. Yes. Serious thing, not tell you. Are you at the place black? Yes. I tell you. Are you make, are you make people know where I go on? Yeah, I mean, what's the last night? Everybody want me to talk about the vibes. Yeah, 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 yeah. Hear me. Hear me. I, I know you have not called upon. Yeah. I mean, I tell you, sir. All right, my friend. Thank you. I'm here now. All right. Hello. Good night. Hello. Yes, madam. Hello. Yes. I have one thing to say to you, Andre. Yes. Please, don't make it happen again here. What you say? I am serious. Don't make it happen again. Don't make, let it happen Make the producer again. here. Oh, listen. Uh -huh. Don't let it happen again. Yeah, yeah. Don't Pro let it happen again. Producer here, that don't yeah. let it happen again. And and that's what I'm saying. And you know what I'm talking about. You can't you can't do that to us. How can you be off the air for two nights? <laughs> hey, yeah, no, PME. No, 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 no. Listen, mm. listen to me. Listen to me. No, make it up my here. All no, right. Me have to come out there to you. No, me, me have to take play and come on to you. Us no, make it up my here. All right, my boy. No, no, no. It's no problem. All right, baby. Me Bless you. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Don't make it up now again. Do, this is my last call. 
Because we have a lot to discuss tonight. Hello? Andre, good night. Yes, madam. I'm only giving you one night. One night. Only one night. Not two. Oh, so I can't get like a one night, but not two. One night out of the month. That's enough. You hear? One night out of the month, producer. One night. Okay, I love you. Bye. Where's it? The producer said him not look for one. Sometimes it's not me in Jamaica. Tell you the truth, it's not me. It's really not me. It's the team. So sometimes when you don't see me, it's the production crew. Remember, say me can the production in. And one night me take by the production team, take the next night, so me just work with it. Mm. Yes, man. But we have the, the matters to discuss now. Some young girls are, would say teenagers, are missing. And we need to find them. Let me put up their pictures. Let me go on off of the screen. I'm here. Just a moment. Hearing me and are you seeing me? Yes, Jamaica. Three missing girls. Three missing girls. Can we show them? Well, I need your help. I need your help, Jamaica, to identify three missing girls one is called naya anderson naya anderson she attends the kingston technical high school she was last seen in her uniform with her here catch up in one it is said that she left for school on the 12th of march and has not returned her name is naya anderson if any one of you have seen her, Naya, this one. I'm asking for your assistance tonight, Jamaica, to find Naya Anderson. Just 16 years old of Kingston Technical High School. The 12th of March would be this week, don't it? So about two that she has been missing from. So if you know of her whereabouts or stay in your community. 381-7565. 381-7565. Or you can send me a WhatsApp. If you know where she is, Jamaica, send me a WhatsApp. Let me get the information to the family. So this is Naya. Let me show you the next one.
The next one is called Krishana Martin. She's from Queens High School. Krishana K. Martin from Queens High School. She's about five feet tall, dark complexion. If you need the number for Krishana family, it is 708-1487. or 810-9771. All right, Jamaica. She is Krishana Martin from the Queen's School. Or you can call the Glengough Police Station. Let us go to the next one. Natisha Lee. Natisha Lee, Jamaica. She's 14 years old. She's from Spanish Town High School. She was last seen at the Bashko on Burke Road, Spanish Town, wearing the Spanish Town High School uniform. If you see Natisha Lee, 8309296. 8309296. We need to find them. We need to find all three of them, Jamaica. Urgently. Urgently need to find these young girls. It's three of them. That is a lot. All teenagers. All teenagers. Sometimes in a Jamaica, I don't like to talk, but sometimes I run them, run, go, go to them boyfriend, you know. But them parents are worried for them, so let us hurry up and find them, all right? Can we assist in finding them? Who is going to assist me in finding them? Show back the three, the three pictures so people can know. Take a good look. Mm -hmm. So that is Krishana Martin. And this is Natisha Lee. All right. And this is Naya. Naya. So I'm asking anybody who knows the whereabouts of Naya. I got something about Naya since evening. She's back home. Whoa. Hi, ladies. Need your urgent prayer for the release of my granddaughter, Naya. One of one of our members. She was kidnapped on her way from school downtown Kingston on Tuesday by two masked men. And they're asking for a ransom of $250,000. You hear that? In the church group, it says that she was kidnapped. And the men are asking for a ransom of $250,000. So I'm asking you all, anybody out there who has seen Naya, please report it to me or the police. Let us find Naya and get her back home. All right? We can have her on. Yeah, but them said ransom two hundred and fifty thousand. Mm. Mighty God. All right. So let us see if we can find the young ladies. And anybody have any leads? You can WhatsApp me the leads, and we'll take it from there. All right. There's going to be a strike at UTEC. UTEC is going to have a strike on Monday morning. I gather that the compensation package for the lecturers are still, has still not yet been completed. And the lecturers have grown weary. So the lecturers are letting them know that there's going to be a strike 
at UTEC on Monday. I think this is going to be the second or third sure. strike since the start of this this term. Semester. This semester. Yeah. So I'm just letting you know if you have your children going to UTEC on Monday morning, the lecturers are planning a strike. Why am I feeling for them, you know? Feeling for the poor people, them. And school fee not cheaper, you take, you know? Mm. School fee not cheaper, you take. So the University of Technology will be having a strike on Monday. So I'm just letting you know. Hmm. I'm just letting you know that that is coming. Why? Me no want to go to West Milan, you know. Why? Jamaica. As we speak this evening, not that one. As we speak this evening, a delivery man was killed in West Milan. And a farmer was attacked and injured. A delivery man was killing West Milan this evening, as we speak. And a farmer was also attacked and he's injured. But then the big story a lot of you might hear of is the one of the businesswoman, the said businesswoman. The businesswoman who got 40 gunshots how much 40 that means about two man shoot her how much come in a one clip so so she got all over 40 gunshots today but the news is reporting that she's not so innocent jamaica she said to be the aunt of a known gangster in St. James in the Glendevon area. So I gather that the police and residents are saying that she's not innocent. She was killed today in the Darleston area of Westmoreland. Yeah. So Westmoreland is now the, the hot crime scene of jamaica every day for every you know see, every day from this week i come on this program there is a dead in westmoreland so i gather that she's she's 32 years old mm -hmm. them call her pinky sudin that she named sudin something um uh they said that Nobody says she, everybody talk about she's a known gangster. But it's like through the whole heap of crime happening in St. James, she migrated to yes. Westmoreland. But they wouldn't have it there. I don't know what kind of business she do. But them say she's a businesswoman. Um, but 40 gunshots, mighty God. That sound like lottery scam. Party. Are probably that's the amount of people that her nephew has killed. Hmm? Producer say I think eight somebody for shoot them 40 times. No. Can't check. Well, what do you think about that? Contract. A contract killing. But the, what he's saying is that to shoot somebody so much time, it must come from a position of hate. So he must say it's a hate it crime. Dead then. She be dead for me. Mm. Mm. <laughs> Remember to send me the link to me send it to I mm -hmm. And she was out on bail. Yeah? Yes, yeah, she was out on bail for murder. Yes, she was out on bail for murder. So she's a known gangster in the area. 
So Pinky never have luck this time. She never have no luck this time, Jamaica. Pinky never have no luck. But 40 gunshot, hey, and it's since evening them killed the delivery man down there. So if me you know say you, so that means nobody not go want to do no food delivery and say in a Westmoreland soon. You know? It's a personal matter, man. I think it's coming from a, a position of hate, as my producer said. It's coming from a, a position where, no, Courtney, if you're here, me get an invitation for go away, small and tell I am me. not going. When me again, I go. Mr. Seminar, I go. You alone go. I'm not taking that check. <laughs> or we can do it virtually. Yeah. I'm not carrying it in. Well, never know where small and would I get so active and hot. But this is what is happening in West Milan, people. Pinky. Pinky is dead. 40 gunshots. Mm -mm. Imagine nobody dying. Bullet written. Eh? <laughs> you can't identify her. Mm -hmm. You can't identify a body that has had 40 gunshots. Mm. That's a lot of gunshots, you know. Is how much gun that? About two gun. And most two gun empty Panera could no one. Mm. I could no one. One can But Jamaica, nowhere is safe again, but they are now reporting that the parish of Clarendon the parish of Clarendon is said to now have seen a reduction of crime by 42%. Let us, them say Clarendon is, Clarendon crime rate is down by 42%. That's a major dip in crimes for Clarendon. You know, Clarendon, when you get dead in a Clarendon, you know, a three or four, you know, Three them shoot up the bar them in a Clarendon. Shoot up the bar them in a Clarendon. Them shoot up the bar. Them roadside. Yeah, you remember even the family of the five way Russian bonnet. It stab up and kill. Mm. Appear mass killing in a Clarendon, but for Clarendon to come down. You think the boys were again? I'm not sure if the police working because none of the places don't have vehicles. The people, the police station, I'm not only have one. One next one. Marvin did tell me, you know, I think about three police stations only have one functional police vehicle. So I don't think it's the police working. Probably the criminals have migrated from Clarendon. So it could be that could be that but i can tell you jamaica that clarendon is down back we can't comment them no anybody from clarendon and they call me and tell me one other down there send me the link <coughs> when they need to tell me what you're doing down clarendon why the crime rate down so much Or probably the police, them now lack of the dance, then. You know, probably it could be that. The police, them now lack of the dance, so the criminal, them stay in the place and enjoy themselves. All of, All of that. Could be that. I want to know what are the strategies being implemented in Clarendon. Because if you're down by crime by 42%, that's a major reduction. Where them gone? Oh, they got across the border. The criminal them must go and cross the border could they migrate. Uh, Are them gone at 80? Remember, say Rocky Point they say no, so they probably take the what is them? Barbecue them gone. Them gone at 80, gone at barbecue. Mm -hmm. Them gone to barbecue. Uh, 
I must apologize. Them say them Ghana West Milan. Oh. Probably are true. I must apologize for Mr. Ratigan's absence. Uh, he said, I must tell you all, he'll be absent for the next five weeks. All right? He's going to be absent for the next... Yes, my disappear. Oh, be them do a clarinet. Oh, you know that lady? <laughs> you know the last time I talked about that, my message me already for cost me shut my mouth. So, Mr. Ratigan is going to be absent for the next five weeks, Jamaica. Yeah. For the next five weeks, he won't be here. You know, it's Ramadan. It's that time of the year. It's Ramadan. And he has to make sure that he observes Ramadan. So for the next five, five, five Fridays, Mr. Ratigan won't be here. Hello? Andre? Yes. I uh, remember say is Carlos Russell is in charge of Clarendon um, now and also. I'm doing a good job down there. I'm from Clarendon, but I'm living in Kingston now. Oh. I go there, I go there yeah. every weekend. Mm -hmm. And I know that he's doing a very good job down there, man, in Spain. Oh, That's so they have the police high command when you Carlos Russell. Carlos Russell, yes. Doing a good job. Love you, Messi. Oh. oh yes. Mr. So Russell, the people them say you're doing a good job down there. So. Yeah. Doing All right. Person. Thank you for telling me. So you think the police have a major role to play in it? Yes, yes. Mm. And they do community policing as well down there. Like what them do down there? They go into the community and, and talk to the youth and all of these things. Oh. Yeah. Oh, okay. All, all right. right. Yeah, man. Thank you for giving us an update on what is happening. Okay. All right. God bless you. So them say, when they say Carlos, when they Russell. Russell. Mm, Mr. Russell. Let me see if I can't find a picture of him. Only know me staring. Yeah, they do good, they do good. They do bad, they bad. So the teacher said. Yeah, man. <laughs> I sleep up now. Oh. Oh, see me. It's a Carlos Russell. He said, there's no place for criminals. See me, my team. See him there. Mm -hmm. Happy, me happy. Do that. Mr. Russell and his team doing a good job down there. Huh? Well, my cousin, and as we talk about that Monday morning, Monday morning, we're going to have a new commissioner of police. Yes. Mm. Finally, Jamaica, we have a new commissioner of police. Google, uh, huh? Google, 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 we don't know where I'm going yet, but. There's going to be a new commissioner of police come Monday morning. Only happy say the next one, girl. I think it's a relief for the country for know so the next one, girl, don't it? Only not happy say Andrew, Andrew, Andrew Booz and Bodyguard. Hmm? On the happy say, Google Gaga Gan. Call you in a glad. Overjoyed. Come the man and tell me, no man. Today was him last day. Sunday is him last day on the work. Sunday is him last day on the work. But you know what I would want to do too? I want people to call me and tell me. What they expect from this new commissioner of police. It's a serious thing that you know. What do you expect from this new commissioner of police? Lord God. 
Hello, good night. Hello. Good thing. Good thing to Google. Not hearing you, sir. You have to talk. Good thing to Google. I'm not hearing you. Good thing Google Gaga gone. Good thing Google Gaga gone. All right, no problem. Bless yeah, you. Him, 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 if he carried a little, a little private, he carry with him too. All right, no problem. Mm -hmm. Yeah, hello? The king one. Huh? Me glad same time, the king one. You glad same gone? Yes. Mm. All right, bless you. Mm -hmm. Yeah. No. Mm. Hello, good night. Good night, Professor. How are you doing? I'm ah, good, you know. How are you doing? I can't complain. Mm. But nobody listening. But from the commissioner, I expect that <coughs> because IT is his background. If you look talk up, talk up, talk up. <coughs> yeah, I'm saying from the commission, I expect from the commissioner uh -huh. that he will he will be focusing heavily on cyber crime. Cyber yeah? crime. Yes, because most of the activities that are happening now is relating to cybercrime, whether people entering people's accounts and stealing money, or you have the ATMs, people cloning your card. So it, there has to be a serious attempt. At you're cyber. very low. You're very low. You hear me better now, teacher? Mm -hmm. I'm saying there has to be a serious attempt at cybercrime. Mm -hmm. Yeah? Yeah, and that is his that is his skill set. And if you looked at Mark um, Shields' speech in relation to him, Mark Shields gave him a vote of confidence. He says, "I believe if this new commissioner implements the, these these cyber crime initiatives mm -hmm. and also look at upgrading the force to be more, you know, more technological driven in terms of its gathering of of evidence and so mm -hmm. forth." Yeah. So I'm looking to see a, a level of transformation. The force must reflect modern day policing and modern day policing techniques, which is similar to in the UK and 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 and, and, and the US. All yeah. right. So you yeah. say you're looking for right. to transform the police force. Yes, with uh, technology and and and, and um, innovation. All right. God bless you for that. Okay. Okay, my friend. Yeah, bless you. Technology and innovation. Hello. God bless Hello? Yes, good night. Yeah, good night, Andre. Mm -hmm. Um, I wonder if I am going to lead the Jamaican Defense Force in Haiti. Who? You think? Google Gaga. Well, we're not sure now. You'd have to look and see in the next few weeks. Why? Yeah, man. And and and, and the people them right. The last two days never good. So um tell the producer them say them have to take it off on a Saturday. Anytime them are going to do work, them have to do work on a Saturday. All right? All right, I hear All you, right. boss. Mm. All right. Yeah. All right, stay blessed, my mm. friend. Hello, good night. Hi, uh, good night, Andrew. Yes. Mm -hmm. uh, my, uh, let me say this. If we still continue to have the same Minister of Security, yeah. this gentleman, no matter how good he is, is going to be titled. So you think the security minister is going to start playing? Yes, you need to go too. Oh, so you say, you can't have a new commissioner, have the uh, old minister. Minister, no, not, uh, not based on, uh, on, on, on what they have been doing mm. from, for, the, for the past couple of years. Mm. If, we, if we are to get a good police force uh -huh. right now, uh -huh. we need to have a, a, the minister of national security go. Oh, so you say Orius Chang needs to go? Uh, exactly. To work with this this this, this new commissioner of police. Mm. Who I think who I think will, will, will make a great difference. But if he still has this minister over him, yes. He's going his hands are going to be tied, he's going to be stifled. And he's going to get corrupted too. And he's going to be get to, to be corrupted, to get corrupted. Wow. That's a fact. All right, let us see what, what's the outcome. So you say. The Prime Minister should fire Horace Chang. As a matter of fact, I would mind if all of the other the stream get clean out first too. Oh, so you want the Prime Minister to go too? Exactly. Oh. Because the stream is dirty. 
All right. Let us see what's going to be the outcome. All right. All right. Good night. Yeah, man. Hello. Good night. Yes, Andre. Yes, sir. I want somebody more that feel good. If I did him at the commissioner Who that? right now, it's Renito Adams. Oh, yeah. That are the, that are the only man me feel could have clean up this country here because he nah make nobody know where he might work, what kind of work he might do, or where he might go. Mm. You understand me? I say, so nobody can call him friend and say, Adams are coming, yes, Adams are coming there, so can they more have no phone to use? Meanwhile, he might the only man. Can oh. he move in the office in the on the road? Oh. You understand? Yes, man. That but is you a know good what man. I'm worried about is that this commissioner police that is coming in don't have no operational skill set. Him no know about the road and how to take on operation. Because up here, I team though. Him just an office man. So I don't know him to take on the I don't know where I'm going to take on the road. I don't know Jamaica landscape. And, and then oh, we just have to just watch. We just have to just watch. Well, them say I'm going to use the IT and put in camera and the surveillance to catch the criminal then. Mm-hmm. I'm going to see now. Yeah, I'm going to watch and see. All right. Yeah. Producer say I'm going to use surveillance. And now they're going to monitor we. Now they're going to monitor we and put all the, the chip them in a way. You know the chip them? No, Say no, take the no chip. As you talk about that today, yeah, as you talk about that today, when the Prime Minister launched the needs. Needs launched today. So it's going to suit by the next five, ten years. The only ID we're going to use in a Jamaica, the needs ID. They might get rid of the electoral ID. They pack the driver's license and all them something. They say no going to have one identification. Hey, Mr. Funo. When you see like him test out to know with the EOJ, what the AS is saying, can but he might go make sure he rub out the whole out with the needs. All on the information. All on the information I got in the needs. They're going to know about your picnic. Your picnic, picnic. Your DNA, how much you make, where your value, how much you pay for rent, which man has sent your money, which man not send your money. Lord Jesus, I know no fun, no going to problem. Because I want to idea you know, I have no so you can collect every minute. Then I go monitor how much money you know, collect a Western Union. A money gram. Then I'm going to know, set, I'm going to show up on the system. I want a family, if who are sending the money, then I'm going to can track on it too. The money, I'm going to reach them before it reaches them. If they decide, say, so you can't collect the money. What a bangarang in a Jamaica, we didn't need. <clears throat> Yes, when the Prime Minister launched it today in a, a Jamaica house with the white man, I wonder if we can find the president. Remember, go see me find it for today. We want to hear him. I want to hear him. See it here? Well, Andy. I send it to my team so they can make no hear it. Go on there, man. National identification system. We must go in our needs. We don't know about needs. <coughs> National identification system. Well, enough people. I got fret now. You know, I know Andrew going away business. Um, Olande. See it on my team. Download that and make the people MA. Hello. Yes. Good night. Good night, classmates. Um, I heard you mention about the um the Western Union with the ID business, yes. and if they don't. If the government of Jamaica don't want to give the citizens the, the hard-earned money the family work for to send them, mm. you know what I would suggest the, the diaspora to do? Mm. Send the money from your credit card. 
So yes, if your family don't get the money, mm -hmm. you just dispute it with your credit card and get it back. Oh. Mm -hmm. I had I hopes for the for the new police um Come person on. there because mm. I was like yes Daniel Rowe case will you know mm. move forward and um the frog that beat the girl with the spatula them people there them people there need to lock up mm. and the Kayla and situation them girls they need to lock up but if this man don't know anything then God go with all of us yes. thank you Andrea going back to class all right my dear. Mm. What a thing on us with the needs. Hello. Good night, teacher. Yes, dear. By the time the world are in the jail. <laughs> Where's the bad time needs to implement the world in the jail? You know, sister members and money man, the auditor go on for the KSAMC. You know. Which money man, who, who is right and early. Which part is the auditor go on for the KSAMC? Hmm? Monday morning, I hear it on the news. Um, um, Mr. The, pre the new prime minister will be will said they um they're gonna hold it. Oh, maybe so they're going to hold it. Can you see? Yes, Monday morning. Monday it morning. It's gonna start Monday. Mr. Okay, Monday let's just see if they're going to hold it. The case, you see. By the time the world them that jail, teacher, you know already. Oh, you want them that jail? And them sharp ones. The way I'm not a prisoner in sharp and all woman to over woman prisoner full too. All yeah. right, we could see if it went come on. Mm. Love is suit, yeah. love is suit, American Thank eagle. Thank you, my darling. Hello, good night. Hello. Yes. Good night. A long time we smell bar. Long time, Mr. Long, long time. Mm. A special church link. If you get no link to this, you don't come nowhere there. So a long time grandchild church link and the man in no a tech check. They had no good long time. I want place in Kingsdale. Mm. You know, down there. Long, long time, my brother. So how you doing, Andre? A good man. Go on in a class. Excitement soon come. We are going to the vibes cartel coming soon. Yes, bless up, bless up, bless up, bless up, bless up. All right. Mm -hmm. But it's a serious matter. We play the, play the something, producer. Make them hear them, Prime Minister. Today, the 15th of March, 2024, Nira is now a reality. I handed over the instruments of appointment and gave a charge to the commissioners of NERA. They will now take that charge and with their instrument of appointment from the governor general, which establishes their independence as an authority, they will now manage the entity that will see to the full public rollout of the national identification system. Hear him? Him give them independence and autonomy. Appear friend and company, you know? Peer friend and company in Gaten or Courtney. But only we know when them send soldiers come to us, so we no can, can use all at that time. I go use for the election, you know. <laughs> hey, at that time, go, hey, when you think about it, you know. Yeah, I come if you can, if you have the new needs, I be you can vote. Lord Jesus. And that him I'm going to use, you know? Lord Jesus. Hello, good night. Is that him going to use? If you don't have the next idea, you can't vote. Hello, good night. Andre. Yes, yes. Andre. Yes, sir, good night. Yes, sir, the new commissioner. Yes. What up? What happened to the new commissioner? Talk up now, my friend. You have up the program. Man, may I tell about may I tell about the commissioner, man? The, the new commissioner. The new commissioner. He, he want help, man. He want, he want some advisor. He want either Steve McGregor. Jarl up with Steve McGregor. But Steve McGregor and want... Andrew Wilness puppet. And Steve McGregor. Or a, a bigger food, or, a, or a Adams to advise him. Yeah, but Steve McGregor and Andrew Wilness puppet that. Then I him sent when 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 Andrew Wilness want to find you under bed. No, Steve McGregor him send me. So me not think Steve McGregor would be a good advisor. 
Steve McGregor would have been the Prime Minister puppet. Just the truth. Okay. Mm -hmm. All right, but in uh, ways him need advice. I need Ratigan for advising. Ah, uh, yeah, 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 Smith for advising. My them, them, and him need for advising. Mm. Right, 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 right. And then the needs and the new commissioner align IT. You know, see it appear oh, digital, okay. appear digital business are going to the country. You know, remember what the prime minister say by 2027, the entire country will be digitally inclined. So if you don't, if you're not digital, you're not going nowhere. You know, when next time I go roll out, in the market, the market vendor, they might forget the, the swipe card. The cashless, in, in nowhere, my do. You see, you see, I'm silent. Be a cashless something I'm going to introduce over the, yes, man. Market vendor, if you're not, if you're not at the, 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 the swipe machine. You can't go on them. Him know him know where man do Jamaica. Cons like can't read and write neither, and them I get money. So me not a, But you know this thing. And then when you look in a your bank account, money just a miss, 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 miss. Thousands, Thousands are miss, miss, miss. That's why them want got this digital and its needs to find out how much money you know have. Me gonna be one of the last one them to take it. If me have to take it, cause probably if you not take it Jamaica, them are gonna tell you say there's something they can. Them are gonna lock you up and put you in a lock up. And that will come next. Them can't say me a propagandist, but me know where I come. Me know Andrew playbook. Only oh, you know him playbook. I know him playbook, and him playbook don't look good. Who no, who no know Andrew on his playbook like me? I know him playbook. Hmm? Playbook don't look good. And let me see if they, they well, the attorney come on yet? <clears throat> let me call the attorney and see if him settle yet. Hello, good night. Hello. Hello. Yes, good night. Hello. Good night. Uh -huh. Yeah, what are you saying? I need a number from you. I've been listening to your program from the other night. Turn off the TV, um, Miss. Turn off the TV. No, not the TV. The phone. Let me turn it on. Yes. Uh -huh. Uh -huh. And this gentleman by the name of Isaac. Canada. Ah. Is he in Jamaica? Yes. Sorry to interrupt your other program. He's in Jamaica. Yes, he's here. So he works like out of the country. Would he go to a normal country or whatever? No Caribbean in the Caribbean. I do don't you know that. What do you mean by if he can practice in the Caribbean? Uh -huh. Not sure if he can practice in the Car in other Caribbean countries. I'd like to ask him. Okay, because I have a case in mm. Cayman. In where? And in Cayman. In Cayman? Yes. I want him to defend you. My, my son. Oh. My son. But I wanted to get his number. But from the other night, I, mean, I wanted to ask you. Send me a and WhatsApp and I will give you his office number, all right? Right. Because uh, I'm his Andre, but you know, look on WhatsApp, man. Because you tell me one time to. What's up, you mean? What's up, you are, you know? Lord, lady, uh, enough no. people, enough people me have to talk to, but send me a WhatsApp and I'll definitely listen. No. All, all right, right, all right. What a thing right. woman say me not listen to WhatsApp, me not read to WhatsApp. When you can't do me, buddy. Hello, good night. Hello, good night, Andre. Yes, good night. What are you doing, teacher? I'm good. Okay, glad to know you, uh, teacher. If I that Andrew, I go use to get this section. Man, that Andrew is going to roll on King Street, you know. Lord Jesus. Because when I ramp with Andrew, you know, the teacher. Mm. Andrew, I do too much things now, you know. Mm. Okay. Say, say, now, nah, make him get to it. We now make him get to it, you know, because Andrew no more than Jamaican people. We get up for war, we war, you know. And a civil war, Andrew was in a Jamaica. 
Like, all right, my dear. Civil war. Oh. Mm mm. Mm -hmm. Interesting times. But I'm going to have Mr. Buchanan joining the live shortly. He's settling in Jamaica. I'm settling in. Ah. Jubilance everywhere. Jubilance everywhere. Jubilance everywhere, Jamaica. Is who this calling? Hello, good night. Good night, Congress. Yes. Let me ask you something. The needs, you see? Yeah, the needs? Yes. Tell me something. If you don't take the needs, you can't buy nothing or nothing. It's about, it's about the bank. Uh -huh. You have to use, you have to have the needs, so you go buy something or what to pay bills. Well, they're going to roll it out and tell you soon what and what it don't do. I don't want to lie on them. All right, well, we have to monitor it to see what more them going to come with. Okay, my darling, because I know I'm not taking on it. All right, no problem. Mm -hmm. Okay. Yes, good night. Welcome. Peter, how are you? I'm calling from Florida. Yes, I'm good. Glad to you. I listen to you all the time. I want the director of public prosecution to resign in Jamaica. Oh, yes. You're not realize a bloody session must resign. Paula Llewellyn, don't it? Pa Paula Llewellyn must resign. There is no credibility in her because she moved the case forward when the jury was being painted. Yes. So I'm calling on all the I'm calling on all the diaspora, all Jamaicans. Yes. Vice Carter would not have a fair trial if Paula Llewellyn go to the appeal court and yes. says she wants a new trial. So I'm calling on all Jamaicans in the diaspora. And around the world, mm -hmm. Paul Halloween, Paul Halloween must go. There is no credibility. There is no justice. Yes. If to go forward with the case. And Vibes Carter will not have a fair trial in Jamaica. You understand what I'm saying? So you're saying no, no retrial must happen? You can't have a retrial. With Paul Halloween there. With, with Paul Halloween there. Uh -huh. And she must, she must go. If you're going to have a retrial with Paul Lewin there, then that means Vice Carter will not get a fair trial in Jamaica. Mm. You understand what I'm saying? Mm. And so I am calling on all the people around the world yes. to make sure that Paul Lewin go once and for all. Okay? All right. And all we right. must keep the Privy Council. Right and then. keep the Privy Council. We must keep the Privy Council because if you're you remember when Andrew appointed uh, the Chief Justice of Jamaica mm -hmm. and say he was he was temporarily appointed and there was no such thing in the constitution of temporarily appointed, you remember? Yes, yes, I remember. And so therefore, Andrew want to put his judges there. You cannot have a fair trial by justice in Jamaica today. Mm. Okay? Okay. And and so therefore we have to also change the constitution mm. that when the Premier Council said it must go back for the judges to, uh, for the appeal court to say whether they want the retrial or not, you must have a 72 hours window yes. to come up by two weeks, yes. you must decide. But there's no law on mm. the statute book of Jamaica yes. to, say, to say that. The judge has to have 72 hours. They can have it for six months, a year. Yes. Because they can take the time. So we need to change the law. Yes. And the people in, um, where five Carter come from? Is it Waterford? Yes. Where, 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 where? Waterford him come from. Yes. So the people now is saying they want to keep the premier council. And I am been saying with, but you need to get value with the Robins on your program. Uh -huh. We need to keep the we need to keep the Premier Council for the final court of appeal in Jamaica because Jamaica is too small and the Caribbean is too small mm. to give it to these to give to give it to these people because yes. it's not who it's not who you know, 
is who know you will yes. get away. You understand mm. what I'm saying, Andre? You understand. You, you have my number, call me, and we will debate it, and we we'll go further with it again, okay, my all, brother? All right, my friend. Bless you now. God bless you. Let us play. I said, but cannot response in the UK yesterday. We're What's going, up? We're going now into the the matter of the vibes cartel verdict yesterday in the privy council god and time and we always we always know that god and time and a quash one that has evoked a sense of joy from those representing the appellants for one isaac buchanan attorney for a deja vibes cartel palmer is loving every minute i'm very happy about that um it was a just decision it was the right decision and it was what was expected and as expectations reach fever pitch among supporters, the question among many is what does it mean for Mr. Palmer and his team? Standing outside the Privy Council, just minutes after the judgment, Mr. Buchanan gladly responded. What it means is that in the same guidance that they had sorted, the, the judges have the discretion now to deal with the matter at the local level, which, which is in keeping with judicial independence, in keeping with our independence and what our constitution speaks about. Julian Malins KC, who was a part of the legal team for Sean, Sean Storm Campbell, says the Privy Council made a sound judgment. Well, I think it was entirely the right decision. They're on remand now, not convicted persons so we regard this uh, uh, as a very big win. Mr. Palmer is not a convict he does not have a conviction Mr. Sean Campbell does not have a conviction Mr. Um, Andre St. John is not convicted on this matter and Mr. Keras Jones his conviction is quashed on this. Meanwhile it's the hope of attorney Linda Hudson that the Court of Appeal considers all the relevant factors one that immediately comes to mind the time that the appellants have spent in custody and also media publicity etc but i'm sure or i feel comfortable that the court of appeal will come to the right decision on that and in the event there's a retrial miss hudson says there's one question at the center of it all and whether a fair trial is at all possible there were some supporters of Mr. Palmer who were unstoppable. The men said they had to be at the Privy Council on Thursday for the judgment. I know who say there's not a hundred percent to say my man guilty them we are there to how they try to portray him. You understand? I'm not saying he's without sin, but there's a lot more to this and they're not giving no justice. When you look at the, the evidence the, and how the court deal with it in Jamaica, you can see it was an unsafe conviction, you know, and a lot of um, violation of rights. And here in the, in the UK, then deal with your rights. Ramada Lyons, TVJ News. God and time. What do you know about God and time? Greetings, Mr. Audrey. How are you doing? I'm well, counsel. How you reach back so quick? You know, I was on my, you know, I was on my private jet, and I said I didn't want to miss the um the the show, so I said speed up, you know, pilots, and they, they land on the um the tarmac, and I got diplomat um service, you know, and and yeah, now I'm home, you know. I don't know if my hawk sense working, but yes, it's I, I'm doing my best. But my <laughs> friend. <It's doing> it. <laughs> My friend, oh, yeah, you're the most sought after attorney in Jamaica as we speak. And nobody I saw me, I'm not getting a KFC. I lie, I lie. Big up that way, come and get me KFC. But no, no, what are you talking about? I said, but Canon, yes, you did you the do. unthinkable that many said it's a foolish, you're wasting your time to go to the Privy Council. Yes, many I'm argued correct. that. Nothing was going to come out of this ruling for you. Many said that it's a waste of time. What's your response to them tonight? No, I, I, not, no, I don't want to respond to those. It's more, it's more like the people who said that cartel should fire me. Because mm. he's an idiot lawyer. 
um, is more is more about um, my response is always to um, do the work that you're supposed to do. Um, stay focused. Um, if you believe in something, you 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 make sure that you do it. And and most importantly, um, even if you when 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 you get the opportunity to speak to Mr. Palmer, he will tell you that um, the rights is not just about Mr. Palmer, but it was the rights for all of us, fair trial for all of us, the possibility that our constitutional rights would be withered away by those who are in positions that could do that. And so um, I'm, 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 I'm focused. I have no bad energy um, to, to give to anybody. And although my grandmother is from St. Thomas, and I'm proud of that. Oh. And yes, and, and although she's from St. Thomas, may her soul rest in peace, um, I'm entitled to, 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 to keep humor. It is important to, to, to smile, to laugh, and, and, and do the work that you're here to do. I'm never worried about all, all the legal luminaries who never went to law school and some never go to school, none at all, but always have something negative to say. But we are to give everybody the, a fair opportunity and want equality and justice for all. That's my answer. That's my response. So your client, mm -hmm. almost 12 years behind bars. And counting. And counting. And counting, yes. It's man, it's 12 years counting, almost 13. Yes. Almost 13 years behind. Yes, that. yes. And a day and in prison is like a thousand years in thy sight. So while persons are twiddling their thumbs, I just want people to appreciate that the God and time, but time is 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 so precious to man because we don't have a lot of it. To know that he has been put behind bars under the under such mishaps that has been identified by the Privy Council. Mm -hmm. The mishaps of jury uh, tampering mm -hmm. and knowing that there are evidences that are questionable that yes. were used in the court case. Do you think that your client would possibly, after being released, consider suing the state? So, well, if him sue the state, him sue us. Well, may, maybe that's why so many people are interested to say, oh, him shouldn't get him right. Um, it would, uh, he, his potential, listen, Vibes Cartel is a national treasure. Just like how them, them rob Usain Bolt and Usain Bolt have the blessings to make back the money, um, he can make the money. But if him sue, I don't wrong him. But would I advise him to sue? No. Because if you remember who Millwood was and all the people who sued, when time you sued state, you're dead. So, so you say it doesn't make any sense wasting your time suing that state? No, it's not that. I'm just saying sometimes when you have capacity, when God gives you capacity, you are to um, use your blessings and, 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 and get tenfold because those who mistreat you, their reward will be tenfold as well in the negative. Sometimes you just have to be still and know that God is God. That's, that's let my, us play, that's my let us play what the Privy Council said yesterday. I want to play it so some people who didn't get the chance to hear it, hear what the Privy Council said, and then we come back to, you will no well learn that, learn that journey here. The most sought after attorney in Jamaica and the Caribbean. The Judicial Committee of the Privy Council has unanimously concluded that the appeals should be allowed and the appellant's convictions should be quashed on the ground of juror misconduct and that the case should be remitted to the Court of Appeal of Jamaica to decide whether to order a retrial of the appellants for the murder of Clive Williams. The Board has considerable sympathy with the dilemma faced by the trial judge on the final day of a long and complex trial. Following the allegations of bribery, he had either to continue with the 11 remaining jurors or to discharge the jury. Despite this, the board considers that the approach taken by the judge was a material irregularity in the course of the trial, which makes it necessary to quash the convictions. This is for three reasons. First, the direction to the jury on the final day was inadequate to save the situation. 
The judge simply reminded the jury that they had sworn or affirmed that they would return verdicts in accordance with the evidence they had heard in court. The judge did not refer to the alleged bribery of which, if the allegations were true, the jurors were already aware. Secondly, the trial continued with the allegedly corrupt juror serving as one of its 11 members. In the board's view, there should have been no question of allowing juror X to continue to serve on the jury. Allowing juror X to remain on the jury is fatal to the safety of the convictions which followed. The judge should have considered whether the remaining jurors might have become, consciously or unconsciously, prejudiced for or against one or more of the appellants as a result of juror X's behavior. For example, there was a danger that the attempted bribe could have made the other jurors overcompensate, consciously or unconsciously, if they assumed that the offer must have come from one of the appellants and that therefore they must be guilty. The judge took no account of this risk. The board is very mindful of the serious consequences which may flow from having to discharge a jury shortly before the end of a long and complex criminal trial. It is also very conscious of the danger of deliberate attempts to derail criminal trials by engineering situations in which it is necessary to discharge the jury. In England and Wales, there is legislation which allows a judge in certain situations to discharge a jury because of jury tampering and to continue the trial by judge alone. There is no such legislation in Jamaica. It follows that there will be occasions where, as in this case, a court will have no alternative but to discharge a jury and end the trial in order to protect the integrity of the system of trial by jury. In view of its conclusion on the issue of juror misconduct, the board holds that it is not necessary to express a concluded view on the other two grounds of appeal. For these reasons, the appellant's appeals should be allowed. The court is now adjourned. Yes. Wow. So, basically, all the judges there highlighting were the mishaps of the Jamaican court system. They have highlighted to you, Jamaica, that what the judge should have done, the court of appeal judge should have done, were to quash the case, meaning take out the case against them. So, at present, Vibes Cartel and his co-accused are no longer uh, convicts. They are no longer prisoners. Right, Mr. Buchanan? Accurate. 100% correct. They no longer have any case on their hand. So constitutionally, they are free men. Technically, right? Or Am I correct? I don't no, know. That is correct. So if they are free men, it means, one, the court of, of appeal should give them bail at the earliest possible time. And the court of appeal should either set a date for the retrial or free them wholeheartedly. But then the Privy Council highlights to us I sat won't agree, but I'm going to say the Privy Council basically look at the Court of Appeal, send home back the trial to say, listen, man, God don't, don't know homework and get it right. I believe that's what the Privy Council has done. Because if they look at you and say, send it back to Jamaica court and let them sort it out, I think they have forced the hands of the, uh, of the Jamaican court. Because after 10 years, what is there to, to retry? How are you going to find a jury? How are you going to find witness? How are you going to find tampered evidence? None of the evidence can be used now in the court of law. Because remember, it was said that the police carried the phone, Grime House, and all of those things. How then can you use any of that now as evidence? Where are you going to find new evidence? So if I were the, the government or if I were the court system, I would just show this case. That's what I would do. That's the wealth. 
That is the best practice across the world. So it make the Court of Appeal look very bad in Jamaica. Because as you hear the, your law that talk all of the things and the, all of the mishaps in you know, thing. The man basically said the jury tamper with and continue with that jury that has been tampered with. The man talk about all of that and it simply come to the matter now that the man is no longer a convict. So I'm have to stay there now for Jamaica to decide his future. So Mr. Buchanan, when, when do you plan to go seeking bail for your client? Next week? Not hearing I said. Did not tell anybody I was planning to seek any bail. I see that in the newspaper. Yeah, the newspaper is the one that asking about bail. Because the mm. legal luminaries know for talk about bail. And see people in here, Lisa Williams, are talk about Obia and St. Thomas. But anyway, um, let me let me let me just let me just um set give you some clarity on three things. Yes, please. Um, I don't know if you read the judgment, but the judgment was um at to complete respect for the Jamaican Court of Appeal. Um, I don't think um, it's fair to say that the judgment embarrasses the Court of Appeal. Um, one of the things about the our justice system is that there are three tiers. First instance, Court of Appeal, and then the Apex Court, being the Privy Council. Sometimes you get it right, sometimes you don't get it right. But know that the Court of Appeal is a court of review. They um, would have reviewed what... Justice Kamlu would have done, and they, 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 in seeing the deficiency in the legislation, ratified what he did based on what we, what would be a material irregularity. So I wouldn't say that they, 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 they would have made it seems as if the court of appeal was looking bad, as you would say. So we shouldn't, we shouldn't say it like that. We must understand that um, when it came to fair trial rights and when it came to how the Charter of Rights, which is 2011, would have come into effect and, and opportunity mm -hmm. to test it. Um, we have to look at those things because the appeal, when in 2018, when that appeal was decided, um, we, n we never have the blatant state of emergency issues mm -hmm. and the needs and all of these things never did come up yet to test the, the, the how, how powerful and how potent the Charter of Rights was. And so mm -hmm. there, there, there are many aspects of it in terms of how you argue, how you advocate, what exactly it is that you bring to the table that, that, that can paint a light. Advocacy is everything um, when, it, when, it, when it comes to... Um, I convince in a court as to what the central issues are. And it's a, it's a simple thing. Um, and and so when we when we look into that, and I know it may sound like I'm rambling, the starting point is that where we are now is that you would have rightly said, where where will the evidence come from? Um, not in my nose hole, well, I know that, but there are people with, you know possibly can pull tricks out of their nose holes. So anyway, um, that, that, that being said, no, I was not talking about the Prime Minister. Behave yourself, Audrey. Behave yourself. I wouldn't you know, say two, that, my friend. Have big nose and it's me and the Prime Minister. Leave us alone. But anyway, um, that being said, I, I just want to make it clear that um, we, 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 there are some legal aspects of it that has to come. Right now, people are saying, what is the Court of Appeal doing? The Court of Appeal can't do anything until the Privy Council concludes um, the, the relevant documents and have it sent back to the local courts. But I can tell you this, the law... Oh, so, the Privy... so based on what happened yesterday, right. the Privy Council will have to now write officially to the Court of Appeal in Jamaica? They have to transmit a particular document to the Court of Appeal. So, if so one is what there, time frame are we looking at in a matter like oh, that? I don't work with the court. I love, you know, I love those media questions. I love those poor journalism questions. I love it. Keep it up because I don't work with the court. So when somebody asks me, and one thing I don't do, I don't guess because I don't guess like I'm a prophet and then flop. 
So I don't I don't go out there and talk about yes, July, December, and then Radam, it happened quick and then everybody make it look like you you lie. So I don't make estimates. What I will say is that the jurisprudence in Jamaica when it comes mm. to um retrial um delay is a serious factor and the passage of time is is a is a is a most important thing because you might remember the lot of number them when you dream last night but uh -huh. I know the lot of number them 10 years from now nobody now remember that yeah you have people who used to eat kfc when them young 10 years later them 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 can't eat it no more so, so, yes, like, so you, you, you have a problem or you're contending with the retrial will take a long time. No, what I'm saying is that I, I, my personal belief is um, we balance constitutionality. People have, forget, people have forgotten that this hearing was an expedited hearing. So all things, tr all treatment of this matter will ought to be done on an expedited basis and we'll be taking that type of... Um, approach to dealing with it because in whatever it is mr palmer has medical um a medical emergency i will call it that medical treatment that was anticipated to be done um sooner than later that that the prison system simply cannot and accommodate yeah I, and i would extend to say that i do respectfully don't think that the jamaican healthcare system is something that can accommodate that and if you put it in in cont if you put it in context, because context always matters, it cannot be that um, the rich of this country um, takes flights to Miami to go to Jacksonville Hospital when they have the common call. But you expect some, you expect a national treasure for um, go undergo treatment in um, subhuman conditions, respectfully. No, so we have to con we have to consider that as well. And I'm, I'm gonna leave it at that. So where time frame is concerned, we're working expeditiously from the defense side, as well as I do have confidence in the local court that they they won't take it lightly. I can speak to um, judgments from Justice Brooks, just ju judgments coming from Matt, Justice McDonald Bishop, respectfully, that they take issue with delay, they take issue with the passage of time, mm. they ballot one the, the impact of constitutional breaches is something that they look at and i can ask questions now but i don't want nobody to say i'm attacking people who ought to know what their what the the remit of their job is but um mm. ev evidence is something that um in all countries in the world um the passage of times makes evidence especially in a case where there was nobody a, a, a very very difficult one to overcome and so we will see how we deal with that. Wow. Mm -hmm. So let me gather. Let us now look at the response of the people in Waterford and come back to a further discussion with Isaac. Mm -hmm. An emotional episode. Oh, my dream me. Miss Lucky oh, dream me. This was a section of Waterford St. Catherine called Gaza City moments after the Privy Council handed down its ruling. It's not exactly what they wanted, but for these ardent Vibes Cartel supporters, the ruling represents the beginning of freedom for the self-proclaimed world boss. We're hungry again, we're nice again, and be a class, man, we put again. Big up the vibes, and we get a new class, and be a class, and be a little more, and be a sitting. As the excitement boiled over, the police were quick on the location. But there were no issues here. The people maintained the peace. Jamaica nice again. Nice again. Nice again. Jamaica nice again. World boss is here, man. The years we are wait, we are wait. 10, 11 years we are wait. You hear that we are wait. I wonder what I got, what I got go on. Every minute the thing put off, it put off, see, put on now. It's now minutes to 12 o'clock, and as you can see behind me, several people are still here in Gaza City. They're where they had the viewing party just a few minutes ago. They told me they are now preparing to celebrate later this evening. They say a sound system will be up, although they did not get what they wanted, which was for Vibes Car.
cartel to be free, they told me that a retrial is still something. The decision of a retrial, though, still rests with the Court of Appeal. That aside, some residents were cautiously optimistic. We don't really have a rejoice fully yet, because we are saying it's you not know, really over yet until it's over. So we're still hopeful. Now, Vibes Cartel is originally from Waterhouse, St. Andrew, but he relocated to this section of Waterford with his parents. It's been 10 years since his conviction, yet his presence is still felt in the community. Despite numerous run-ins with law enforcement, the people insist he is a good citizen. So what went wrong for him? In my opinion, I can not blame the system, you know, but it's from people say them like you or someone say them like you or you have to go. That's was it. that was it. That's what happened in Vance Cartel case. Yeah. The system never really you know, so it was too powerful or maybe. In my view in my view. I mean say I feel like for cry, I'm still feel like for cry right now. Like it need to come out free world boss. That's the sentiments what do you of mean? the thing. They, they think I would, they think the I would travel with commoners and, and, and like I'm on. That's the sentiment, Jamaica, of the residents of Waterford, my community, the community that I'm from. And that's the sentiment of many Jamaicans. Yeah, yeah. Gaza. Is there my barn and girl? Gaza, but you don't know enough you because know, you do a whole coverage. We should have said, Yeah, Gaza. So you never know that's where I come from. You never know you was Gaza partner. But no, no. Big up yourself. Big up yourself. What a name, Gaza partner. <laughs> Gaza, Gaza partner. <laughs> oh, we go. Oh, we go. Oh, we go. <laughs> Put the fingers up. Unf unfortunately, unfortunately, I can't participate. God. I cannot participate. The last thing I want is for Muta Baruka to catch a fit. So I won't do any signs because... My Lord. Yes. So... Many Jamaicans want to know, Isaac, mm -hmm. where do we go from here? What's your response to them? Where do we go from here in relation to in relation to what? Vibes cartel, you, you can't have a man with no conviction in, in lockup at 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 at, 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 at and can't come out. They do it all the time. That's what the state of, that's what the state of emergency is. So I gather that about. But then I want to ask, I wonder if I can put Isaac under any pressure tonight. Am I allowed to ask you any hot questions or let us believe it to slide? Well, I might just, I'd probably just not answer them and direct it to St. Thomas because the roads are very good down that side. So careful. What on, must to do at St. Thomas? Careful. Isaac. Not you. Not you. It's all right. Them know. Mr. I sat in the courthouse yesterday, Jamaica. <laughs> Wait, say, him saying, hey, hey, and all the people at St. Thomas, you know, don't know, <laughs> pray me up, and him gathering. I said, what? what I said that? anything about gathering? I hear something about gathering. I don't say nothing about gathering. I never said nothing about gathering. Lie them people telling. That's why you must wear shoes and wear pants, not frock. Yeah. Him come out strong tonight. But I want to know tonight mm -hmm. if the state denies Carter. Denies. The yeah, because you know the state is a very complex one. Suppose they decide not to grant him bail. If they decide not to grant him bail, it would be within the remit of the law not to do so. So I don't know why we're still on the bail, the bail thing. I never said I was gonna ask for any bail. But I hear thing? other, I hear other attorneys. I'm not them. Oh, I thought it was a. I you I deal I deal with the law, so I don't know. But anyway, continue. So I gather then that one of the priorities or its prerogatives is to. Seek medical attention as he comes out. Um, that is correct. So that is priority number one for him. And then how do you see it from there? What, when he's out? Yes. Music? So so how me see it from them is uh, me and my crew will buy a printer. Big up Dion and big up Lexi Chow from Coda. 
we buy a printer, we got print up, bundle the ticket. Because we're here, so the, the show, the ticket for the show, the skybox is 12 million. The, mm. the, the, the cabana is 3 million. Mm. Um, the, the, the VVIP is 200,000. The VIP is 150. And the bleachers, <laughs> 30 grand. But we are going to print up the ticket, then bandulo. Call me. And we're going to tick it. And then still, I'm going to get in at the dance for free. My style. Yeah. Hashtag so the work boss is free. Yeah. So that, that's, that, that's what we're dealing with right now. Now, no time to talk about nothing else. So, so the attorney say that he's focusing on the concert. I said the attorney. I said, say. So no, I have to give you your official. Uh, yeah, you producer and I play my song. I do not play my song. Good night, sir. Yeah. Go, go for him song for me, please. Okay. Good night. We play your song before I said, but I explained to you they who will intricate is the copyright. But I'll take a strike for you tonight. Because I know that I <laughs> no, no, no. you're the producer there. You know something? I go I go come off of this live early. Keep keep your head up. Oh, oh just disclaimer. This blue this blue sweat top is not the one we made love in the, the video. Here it's different. Alright, thank you, thank you. So why did he say that I said nobody never did I look I trouble me on TikTok? In time them see me on TikTok, them bad me up and trouble me about ring and these things and Ask, oh, so show, show us the next sweat top. Show us the next sweat top. Oh, me a rasta and me wear shoes. Like, what kind of something that? Good night, Isa. Good night, good night. You get to it. See it? <laughs> You're afraid of it. Yeah, yeah. Rasta badness. <laughs> Isa, like how we started. What up? Like how like uh, me think them now come up by the time. The party. The party at the church at the March. So we can tell everybody that Isaac will be performing Ed's Eye live. That is party. Vegas. Big up Vegas. Because no. Vegas song is Ed's Eye. No, not not Vegas to song. Your song. Oh, Your okay, song, okay, Isaac. okay. No matter with that, man. You confirm it now, you'll be at the party. Me not worry, I will say for that. If, so my, if, my private, if my private jet run out, of, run out of gas and I'm stuck on the island, then I will be there. But All right. If you're on the island, then. Yes, yes, yes. I, 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 I'll, I will make haste to be there if I'm on the island. All right. Thanks. But All then right. my question to you, I said tonight. Mm -hmm. The common man cannot reach the Privy Council. Appeal today? Many so people can't get the opportunity to go to the Privy Council. But this case has now set a precedence for them. Mm -hmm. What's your response to the many people who can't get justice in this country? No, you know, my response, you know, here, here's this. I, I, am, I am committed. I'm committed to my, my, my life work. My dream is to have a, a rehabilitation center, to have a... a I, I'm not going to call it a legal aid clinic, but to have an innocence project within the Jamaican space. So um, to have an innocence project with, within the Jamaican space. And I know when 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 the time come, Prime Minister is Prime Minister, the opposition leader, Mark Golden, that these are these are things that um, certainly will be on the table. Um, legislation, um, advocacy for legislation that deals with the Innocence Project. Because what has happened from this case, no doubt, is that we should all wonder how many sons and daughters are languishing in prisons with questionable convictions that never got the opportunity to ventilate that or had um, someone advocate for them to, to, to bring to the forefront these things. Um, the dynamics of criminal law within the constitutional realm, using constitutional pro protection to ensure that innocent men are languishing in prison. You know, last year, Antonio Thomas, he went to prison just for being black, dark skin, like black, black, black. Mm. He was shorter than the description and they locked him up and he spent five years in prison and he left his kids without a father. And he, every time he said he didn't do it, they did, nobody believed. But on this very court of appeal, using Ivan Fargas, 
a, a, a case from 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 once again um the united kingdom and mm -hmm. the conviction was quashed and so um it's it is it is trying to find in these pockets and i mean when you go to when you go to gp and you go to spanish town sometimes you see them but you can't help everybody and i would just say that one we we, we continue to work towards um doing that and when when donald trump becomes president again um i can engage him because i heard he was looking for me um he, donald he, trump he, looking straight forward yes see, see, see there you believe vibes cartel won his appeal today does anyone have cartel's lawyer's number you, you heard that <laughs> <laughs> play it again <laughs> play it again send it to me, send it to me. i want to hear it i want to give him a number for me yeah send me, it to me vibes cartel won his appeal today does anyone have cartel's lawyer's number <laughs> send it to me now i sat <laughs> like i said like, like, like i said it though what a thing Oh, so boy. you can't take off Trump off of the case to me in the US. Mm -hmm. That would be interesting. Yes, I, 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 said, but, it, I said it too. But I, I really appreciate you speaking about the the the, the, the clinic. Mm -hmm. the, that would be interesting to know that you'd start an innocence project in Jamaica. Uh because many people, there are there are many cases in Jamaica who needs that kind of attention no it, it it is needed so when somebody asks me what's next that's that's the idea but, it's a concept that i'm looking for spell it out for me though i said yes spell it out for me in terms of you have to go to the privy council how do you how do you get selected do you have to pay what because i said the privy council is expensive how how does you can explain mm. that to us no no it is it is it is expensive there is something called an informal pauperous application it's the poor mm -hmm. man's application you say get a people bro and we can get now no 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 uh -huh. and, and and they 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 know that you are indigent and um if the if the if the questions um that you're putting the legal issues are are one ripe for attention they will grant the application and they will allow it there's a similar application that you can make to the CCJ. So I, I, I like to speak of both courts to balance in yes. terms of what is there. So access to justice is something that um, is, is always a problem. But I think that is a lack of knowledge. Because before this case, nobody even knew that the Privy Council was a, case, a, a court that you, could, that you could go to. And, and nobody's directing you on how to file the motions doing the motions to get there and nobody so the did. motion is free the motion nothing is free but you can make just like just like in um the jamaican space where you um don't have any money there's legal aid lawyers um, yes there is the same thing there are some times that um the privy council will allow where a case is so where where the issues are so live that they grant an application but like all things you're gonna have to you're gonna always um need funding so um when you come to the the ratigan show and we have the one J jamaica legal defense foundation the, yeah. the funds, um you have to get funding you have to get funding although i've been i've been there three times where i used my money um to 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 be a part of the the to bring the case um for somebody who never had the money so i mean sometimes you're gonna have to do that which is why you want to have a clinic you want to have a project and you want mm -hmm. to have funding um so that you can correct justice because it affects all of us one of the things that people did not appreciate is that when the privy, privy council made their decision yes. in in the vibes cartel matter if they had not let me be correct in the sean campbell and three others matter if they had an adverse decision it would have been mm -hmm. binding in england as well so they would be saying that that type of conduct could be allowed in england and the commonwealth at large and so we we we, we live in a world where we, we know we, we, it's nice to talk about sovereign so, sovereignty and all of that and and all of that but um where justice is concerned justice is a universal concept 
So you can it can it can't be that a man breeds the a man is free when he breeds the air in England. And we need visa for God. That sound right? That means you're not free and you're not breed, mm. you're not breeding the England air. So you don't have the, the remnants of humanity and the remnants of human rights is not is 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 not for you because um the state actors and the powers of be that be treat you less than you like less than a human being. Not acceptable. So that's certainly the direction I'm taking in terms of having a project like that, um, getting funding and doing public education so people know that yeah, there are people who didn't know that you don't have to get leave. You can you can skip leave. So you don't have to ask the Court of Appeal in Jamaica um, to go to the Privy Council if you have the issue, if, if you have an issue that is... So you can, so you can so circumvent... You can circumvent yeah, the privy council correct the, the yeah. court of appeal and go directly to the privy council that is correct oh a mm -hmm. lot of this legal education is very important i said mm -hmm. so you so one of your prior to, so this is going to be a legacy legacy, legacy project for you in yes. terms of I've gone yes, away yes. from the popularity, um, Andre. So I, I, I'm not worried about the now. I, it's, it's about the legacy. You remember who they said that? Who they said that? They say, I don't have no time to worry about um, election. Oh, That's popular. Oh, you're, you're prime minister, said it. <laughs> yeah, <laughs> you're old too. But yeah, so that that's really that's really that's really the aim, and 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 hoping to have some remnants of um legality in in in, in the justice process as um, you know jamaica when budget did come out of prison his concert would be dubbed one of the bigger ones i know that when the world boss as isaac said the national treasure comes out when I wish for them, I forgot to keep that one, that um stage show. Jam oh, Jam World. Jam World can't hold it. Yeah, yeah, no, but me not think it already because it, it need time to get prepared. No, Zone, but it yeah. now already in time fe. But um, I certainly have tickets giving out then. You said uh, me, I'm a crew, I got print up bandolo ticket. I'm telling you that already. I don't know about that, but I know that for sure a lot of people anticipating Vibes Cartel coming back into dance hall. Uh, and many people would argue that dance hall has, has watered down since his departure. His departure. And many would argue that it's time to get back the king of the dance hall on the scene to get the people and the industry again moving and grooving and rocking. I certainly, I, I'm not really a fan of dance hall. It means a gospel. I would really want to see though the king of dance hall do some major collaborations on the international sphere with some of those UK and the Africa, the, you know, I want I said, who that? I'd want to hear the king of the dance hall and the Afrobeats. Afrobeats is the the way of the life now. You really, you, you really what? don't listen to dance hall. I have a million songs. I'm Afro, just Afro Afrobeat Afro artists. Andre, you look like you don't have Starlink, man. What's going on there? Perfume. Thing. This segment here is brought to you by Starlink. If you're in Jamaica and you're not using Starlink, your internet will embarrass you. Who frozen? Me or Andre? 
Oh, so there, I don't know. No, sorry, my friend. Pan Afrobeat? No. I don't know those songs. Hey, something wrong. Oh, so it's definitely not me frozen. It's Andre. Starlink is um, Starlink is the internet ser service by Elon Musk, and um, it pretty much. And it, it it pretty much um is a stable internet, so you won't get much freezing. So you see, teacher teacher is frozen right now. Yeah. What's one advice would you give to Cartel upon his release? Stay away from bad mind. The internet glitch after hearing Andre response. Yeah, Elon Musk. There you go, there you go. That's why they were trying to take away, that's why they were trying to take away your license. Yes, you should do a whole gospel album. What would you say? No, there is Starlink is cheaper now. You know, it's it's half off. It's it's much cheaper now. Well, your, your internet broke down. All right, all right. Yes, yeah, so so that's that's generally that's generally what's happening. You good? That's that's pretty much what is happening there. He'll be returning shortly. It's because him don't have Starlink. When they can't sponsor, yes, Jamaica, are you hearing me? When they can't sponsor Gaza partner with with, with Starlink. Where's the name Gaza partner? Yeah. So where them call you in the Gaza? Gaza lawyer. Uh, you know, man, you have to get a strike a, at a name for you, man. That one day. That one day, no. But, you know, I said, my, <laughs> one of my requests, you know, is yes. if I could get a sit down with, with Vibes Carter, Mr. Palmer, I'd want to have an exclusive with him. Uh, pro even if I'm not doing it live, to have it recorded and curated. Uh, I think that I'd really want to hear his voice. And many people would want to hear his voice into because he's well learned. Um he's someone that I admire in terms of being a lyricist. And him, him, him know the law. And that's why he went for one of the best to represent him. When many never had confidence in you, he stood with you. And I appreciate him for that. So when you speak back to your client. Tell him that pa Gaza partner um, requ requesting a one on one with him. Gaza partner. I, I'm a member of the Gaza community. I deserve my partner, Joe. All right. I hear you. I will pass, Why I'll, that did... I'll pass the message on. Mm. If the price is right. <laughs> the price is so would I really have to pay for that I said no sir Isaac. You, see me here, so you, you see listen now you see me here I tell you say me I prepare for um me I prepare me have my printer ready for sell my bandulo tickets <laughs> for make a money here I come talk about yeah you know for worry about bandulo you get at least one three or five hundred tickets for sale man and for that sale. goes to you Yes. Like, if you're not in Jamaica, you don't do the right thing. Before you fly out, you say, Courtney, link me up. And you do the right thing. You know the right thing. So, but, but listen, don't use yes, those sir. languages, Courtney. Yesterday, I'm going to tell St. Thomas to do the right yes. thing. I'll be a banger. I'll be a banger in Jamaica with a three second. You can use that as a new phrase now. Do the right thing. Yeah. But I'm going to say, Jamaica, have you realized that I said. Should I say this tonight? I said, very good friend, the DPP has been silent. Jamaica, have you realized that 
the director of public pro can be found. No comment from the DPP. I'm surprised that she has not made any comment from the ruling. Normally, typically Jamaica, everybody would hear from her. But a lot of people called me earlier saying that she should do the honorable thing and resign. I don't want Isa to comment on that matter. Uh, but I think most people in the public domain are saying that it's time for Paula Llewellyn to go. Especially what, what the ruling came in, coming out of the Privy Council has said. But that is something that we can debate and talk about. So I said, your Prime Minister <coughs> and your um and the U the US Secretary General had a meeting earlier this week to deploy security personnel to go to Haiti. Mm -hmm. What's your take on that? Or you uh, were caught up? I, I, hope, I, I hope that when he had the, the meeting that he got some money. He so yet, man, they got 300 million US. They got 300 million US? For the Haiti project, yeah. Then my brothers and sisters, put on the uniform and go over Dominica, no? Simple. Don't go here to go Dominica. Do somewhere at the same, at the same, at the same. Know, Land, geographic area. landscape. Yeah, just go over that side there. No lies lost. Just go over there and 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 just touch a button and put on a foot on the soil and come back. And so we, and and then say, boy, boss, he will go over there and I say, terrible, terrible, terrible. So we couldn't do nothing. <laughs> but we try a thing and then split up the three million for the Jamaican people him. And give us some newer road, some new new road. But three hundred million is like is chicken feed for the Andrew Holmes administration when they have a one point three trillion dollar budget. Yeah, but that that one point three trillion dollar budget, they that split up and do some a whole heap of other things. So it's nice to get a little three million, three hundred million here and there for do a thing. So good good work right there, sir. And then the finance minister this week raised the income tax threshold from 1.5 to 1.7. A lot of people think that is $200,000 they're getting more on their salary, not realizing that it really comes down to $4,000 per month. Or $3,000 little bit to $4,000 per month. What's your take on the income tax threshold? I'm not impressed with that. In fact, um, government should get to the point where a, a country such as this, we should do away with income tax completely. And you tax that? that. Yeah, I think so. I think so. I think a country can collect more money if you put the if you tax the particular goods and um, categorize goods, specialized goods, but you allow people to have the money to do what they need to do. We are a developing country. Less teeth in of the money and, and leave the people with the money to do what they can do with it. More money in the people's hand. They'll spend more and they'll do more. And so you're calling for an abolishing an, an abolishment of the income tax? I, I am doing that. Governments wow. won't do it, but I, I know that I, I, this country would strive if that would happen. And take it from a man who runs his own business and don't do nothing with government money. Wow, that's a bold step. I wonder what that, that, that's people, just me. I wonder what people would say to that though. Abolish the whole income tax threshold so that more people, what you're saying, they would have more money in their hands to spend. Yeah. Wow. Businesses would strive as well. But until, 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 until we until we allow people. And you say that's another thing too. When 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 you have money. Mm -hmm. uh, and you're not you're not scrambling um the beggars will strive more as well nothing that's wrong with begging you know so so they will strive more and you'll have enough money to give people and then they won't have to rob you and they won't have to kill you and they won't have to do your things to get your money because mm. sometimes you beg and you say you have beggar money and they're going like them no one give up the money you see what i said so you have bigger thing and you're going like you know come on for the yes, money we'll beg you them things then are right. So you do away, you do away with those things so people can have the money. So when, when somebody like me come and say, beg your money, you have it, forgive me. Oh, so all of that tax could be gone into a beggar's hand. Yeah. 
it would be you would be able to better furnish people and so and so and no and i'm seeing somebody say tax in moderation is a must but that's the that's the that's the whole point is that you'll be able to tax goods and it's goods of choice and so the 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 very esteemed psoj would understand that when it comes to customer service both private and public there you're you would have to have prestigious customer service because you rely on the actual payment from the people from the citizens of the country mm. but them them soon know when the amazon truck them really are go around and you know have to go in on the store them your favorite store are locked down one by one wow but then your the, the finance minister did something that he removed the gct from raw importation raw materials and importation of raw goods that is going to affect the comp the ordinary farmer in jamaica yeah and that benefits the hoteliers because then they can get their fruits and vegetables directly off the crate and off the port and they can borrow my private jet and i'll just bring some prawns instead of shrimp and i'll you know bring you know the fruits and stuff like that on my private jet Tax so do you so do you think the government should re um reclassify or go back to looking into that matter no i so here's what i would say that's a conversation between the finance minister and the agriculture minister because mm -hmm. two messages being sent simultaneously you can't be telling the youths them for go farm and then when them farm and them get them produce nobody's there to buy it because you the, their competitors are from another country that have much more resources so it's it's it's, it's a it's a it's a catch-22 for me so the point, the point when it comes to those things is, um, especially when you say in importing raw goods, a man like me who can't cook, that don't affect me. So I would have said, I don't care. But then all the people who, who, who are farmers and that's their livelihood, they're being cut out. So identical to when you build those nice large roads and you cut out the, the commute in certain areas where the people rely on the vehicles to pass you know so see mm -hmm. there Loxley Gregory said farmers are extinct that's what you're doing I and I and I can tell you about fake Spain and and certain things though though those areas that relied on the traffic when the highways came in they, they became dead and those people had to resort to, to to begging and crime and stuff like that not saying they're doing it you know but the options become thin and you, you can't you can't keep people on a tight rope and and when you know your back is against the wall we we need to do away from that so that trickle down effect after listening to the budget and everybody i i, I saw i went on twitter and somebody said oh he's the best finance minister and all of that no not true because the money is not trickling down and people must have forgotten that when they did the first time when they did the 1.5 people mm -hmm. thought something was nice but then the us dollar went right up same thing minimum wage um went up but then the us dollar went sky high and then people are worse off than what they were before so so we, we must have significant change real change similar to how the um politicians their 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 salaries met the world standard and i'm not mm -hmm. i'm in no way suggesting that every single job in the whether it be private and low and, yes. and public sector meet it but we have to have a real reality and i've been saying this for years and it has mm -hmm. changed once upon a time i would say it takes five hundred thousand dollars for every city for each citizen to 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 live at the standard uh, the human standard uh, it's yes. now six hundred and fifty thousand dollars a month and when we're 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 not getting there because I know families that's leave, living off for some sixty grand, some forty grand, and I want to know how do you do that? How do you do that? Sixty grand cannot fill my private jet. Mm. Understand, Andre? I and it can it can fill your your fridge. With the no, good no, 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 absolutely not. It's, and it it can it, it certainly can't buy my KFC. So it, it, my KFC bill for the month, 60 grand can't do it. So, so I do. So, um, you know, as, as, as 
you have, we have to use we have to use these markers to to say okay these things sound nice for development of the country but at if large. you were if you were in the government's position i said mm -hmm. and you were to put the minimum wage at a reasonable rate what would you put the minimum wage at presently I can tell you this, um, every citizen should wake up with 40 grand a week. 40,000? 40, 40,000 a week, all when you're worthless. So we need a welfare program. We need a welfare program where just for just, just to be a Jamaican, mm. we not charge 40 grand a week just to be a Jamaican. We just get up at nice and feel some of get $40,000 a week. The wall away for have that. 40,000. A week. Yeah. So how would the country manage to do that now? Say that again? How would the country manage to make that possible? That's something that we have to figure out between private sector, public sector, between how we how we how access to education, how we do a lot of things. And so when we start to talk about um, we don't say it anymore about vision 2030 and all of that. But when yeah, we start, has... having, yeah. What I'm saying, when we start having vision, certainly a, a, a utopian society. When I speak of something like that and working towards that, is many things. But I can tell you mm -hmm. that it is close. It is closely related to the value of the passport. Yes. So when a, yes. when, a, when a citizen knows that they can get up and go anywhere in the world because the passport, um, because the passport has value then it, 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 it diminishes the, the, the stress on, on, on the country. Kimmy, is my brown eyes you're talking about? Mm. Okay, yeah. Um, so when you diminish, when you when you diminish the stress and and, and, and the struggle in, in the country, then then we can start having it. And I appreciate this, you know, somebody's saying him yes. drunk. No, no, we know Santa me them at all. Um no, and that's that's the that's the thing about it. There was a time when the Jamaican dollar was stronger than the US dollar. Mm -hmm. But I can but no, it's because somebody saying if if we got 40 grand a week, then bread would be a thousand dollars. That's the quite the opposite. Because I'm saying if the starting point for every Jamaican is 40 grand a week. Yes. I mean it it you can imagine the, the woman then will have nine picnic and then will get 40 grand for each of them. <laughs> I have no happy work. Every day them would have one breed because 40 grand them every every what I just want to I'm I'm using that to say you can you imagine living in a in a in a I can go as far as a community and then want mm. to do something when you're getting 40 grand a week when you can when you can when you can do those things um so that that is that is something that we have to we, we have to work toward that we have a, a, a robust um welfare program not the part part not the part program so yeah where you have to be bad bad poor queen style bad 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 poor and don't mm. have flushing flushing toilet before you can get on the part program and all who have to tell lie how poor them is just to get on the part program no we need a robust thing we need a system where a, a, a young person is bright and, and is brilliant and whether they can be lawyer, whether they can be doctor, when they have that potential that the country makes sure that they put out, especially a country who love them, love to own you when you're doing great on the world stage. Mm -hmm. We must invest in our people. Our, our biggest product is the people. So yes, I would like to even as I'm talking to you now, and yes, I'm a lawyer, I would love to get my 40 grand a week. Okay. So, Monday morning, you're waking up to a new commissioner of police. Yes, I was, uh, we were, we spoke about this last, last week, didn't we? But it is now confirmed that we know. Yes, and I, I knew, we knew it was going to be that called Blake, Yo, Johan Blake. Remember we were saying that? Rohan, James, Rohan, Blake and Blake, yeah. But my question is to you. Mm. If you were to have a sit down with the Commissioner of Police. Yes. Tomorrow morning. Yes. What would, the, what would be the priority agenda you ask him to focus on? I would just remind him that he is a black man. I just remind him that he needs to take care of the youths of this country. 
I just remind him that the the the, the, the young men who, who have decided to be police officers, that he is a, a demonstration that if they work hard enough and have the ambitions that they too can one day hold that post. And so they mm -hmm. should do their job with the, the type of integrity and, and, and probity and honesty that it requires and also do it with compassion. I think um, the ability to stop crying, it starts with the JCF. I believe that under his no watch, and I don't have to sit down and talk to him. Other people can tell him, yeah. Mm -hmm. But under his watch, he should de he should develop the type of community policing that would allow government to be afraid of him with the type of power that he has. And police can know that they can use and exercise situation ethics because the end all mm -hmm. is not to turn ordinary citizens into criminals. Is to have the citizens of the country trust the police so much that when they see crime happening, they tell the police knowing that because they don't want it in their community. And I think that he can now do it because he's neither he's neither half half white or white. And the majority of this country is 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 represented by um by us as the Africans. And I'm in no way suggesting that they 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 the upper echelons of society that is the other part of the outer many one that is living good and is not experiencing crime at a level as, at, at the grassroot level mm. um he can make that difference so i'm very happy that he, he that he he was chosen he was my pick and i don't know really? if I know. he was my pick so you never call on fix bailey i thought you had courage in fix bailey. fix bailey minute you said bailey bailey and rum mean drunk I said that mm. already. I, I said that. I don't. It, I, I don't take that back. He was my pick, and he got it. He doesn't. And he has no. I'm not committing crime, so he doesn't have to like me. But notwithstanding, mm. I always split justice. So we, we, now that we are there, I think that he's to get the he's to get the maximum amount of leverage, respect, and opportunity that Google Gaga had gotten in all mm. his time. And I know that just when him wake up in the morning, he's going yes. to do better than Google Gaga. Me not ask Christ. Say, so you believe he'll be a better commissioner? Yes, all him have to do is get... Uh, and this, this is why the message and the, and, 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 and the direction must come from the people to him. Because he just has to exist and he will be better than Google Gaga. So it means that he starts at a superior point than Google Gaga. So he must now demonstrate the, the, the creme de la creme of what it ought to be. So his legacy may not be that he has reduced crime, but that he has put it in a, he has put us on a level mm. where we can respect the JCF because it's enough youths and young women. Yeah. And so youths is both, but you know what I mean, man and woman. Yeah. In mm -hmm. young youth. Well, I'm telling you, ambitious. Um, if I had the money, I'd have sent the whole of them go law school. Not that they're gonna have to be, not that they're gonna have to go in the court and be lawyers, but they can be in yeah. the force, develop themselves, and have the, the, the have the have the requisite skills. Because a lot of them are 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 bright. Them so you're asking him to focus on boosting the, the morale of the police, the police boosting police. it, boosting it, boosting the, and 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 the morale that we're talking about is the morale that we are talking about is to build public confidence because that's how you fight crime oh yeah so i've seen and the relationship with the citizen and the police yes 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 the other day when they suspended or they sanctioned um those officers um and i found what that what they were doing was so ingenious if I say the word right, when they say I'm a police the ones officer, that, um, I'm a police I'm a officer. Police. Of course, yeah. We have to know when sarcasm, when satire, when things are being used, and it, it's not, it's not bringing down the morale. It's allowing people to 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 recognize the hu to to the human the humanity, yes, to the, the the human element of of the arm of the state that is there to protect and serve. Mm. And I can tell you this, um, I had I had an excellent experience at the Falmouth police station. Really? E yeah. Excellent, excellent experience. 
I, I, so what, I, and I want to tell you tonight that mm -hmm. Clarendon has seen a significant dip mm -hmm. in crime from since the start of the year. They're saying that the crime rate in Clarendon has gone down by 42%. Mm -hmm. That's a major reduction in crime in Clarendon. Uh, and I gather that what you're talking about, the citizenship participation mm -hmm. and the whole citizenship and the, the citizens and the police boots sing the moral. I get to understand that Mr. Russell down there has a lot of community policing initiatives. I think that should be a main. I don't believe that the whole drive on the whole technology, 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 and the coming the, the com the police response not being driven. Because you can't have technology and the people not working the technology the right way. Mm -hmm. Andre. Ah. Andre. Let me tell you something. No technology beat a woman in a 90 and her mouth push up and she said, So when she gave that one there and said, They're over there. So <laughs> no, the no, no criminal can escape in nearby bushes when Miss Matty. Nearby bushes. When Miss Matty with her milk tea. Mm -hmm. Jamaica I you think Jamaica I can 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 get round that you mm. think Jamaica no Jamaica I can't say see the criminal there no but when but you that when 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 you when you go for the CT footage and you hear saying yeah. record over in a seven days mm -hmm. my lady will sit up on her veranda and say yes last week so I so come uh, mm, see that mm -hmm. <laughs> Yeah. Hey, yeah, I right. see them big women with them lift up them mouth. Thank you. That is the sweetest thing, you know. So, and I'm telling you, when the citizen says certain things can't go on in them community, no matter how you big and bad, it can't go on in the community. And, and the technology so, can't beat it. Can't beat it. Can't beat it. Can't beat it. Because so, remember, so the tech, you remember last year I sat. Me no yeah. you remember. In the Daniel Row matter. You may not think you remember this. The same technology failed us when they remember them told us that the cameras popped down or the camera them did have hacking the same mm. week daniel Rowe. Then, yes 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 um so the cameras don't oftentimes get us the right you understand so what is true when the citizen talk man is the best response you get when the citizen talk is the best response you get. It, that, 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 that's, that's what it is. It is the people who must take back their communities. Listen, man, may I give him the gold star from now? And I know he's going to do well. Um, I'm, I'm, yeah. So we, 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 we probably but should. What skip. is your timeline, though? I'll ask you, though. What's your timeline? It Five certainly two. won't be. It, it won't be 100 days. We are giving him six have, months? No, I I will give him I will give him to the end of the um the uh, the administration right up to the end of the when the calling of the general election. So I so don't know. Him can get eighteen months. No, no, general election can't take so long to call. We are about twelve months more. I may say him can get eighteen months. So eighteen months to prove himself. Him not him improve himself already. I say from here, say by the, the commissioner of police, I say, look how Jamaica run good. Hmm. But Already. I gather that he he is the he is the nephew. Yeah, 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 yeah. But you, you can be the son, you could be the son of Methuselah. All of him is the hmm. all of him is, him, him is the nephew of um Ellington and all of that and whatever. That is of no moment. He is his own person, he's his own individual, and that is good. Sure? Because many I'm people sure. are of the view that nepotism will step in and Mr. Owen Ellington will. No, no. Well, look how, look how, look how me a good, 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 good PNP and me see my father is a good, good labor right. And nobody do it for <laughs> Your father <laughs> labor right. I'm just joking. No, no, no. I'm afraid, I'm afraid of the prime minister. Hey, but the hear me door knock, no open it. Because he might have watch. Don't come for me. He might watch, man. It's come, no comedy. Big what, I'm saying is, what I'm saying is we must have we must we must give people autonomy um the ability and that's what we want we can't just assume mm. that 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 because he's 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 related to and that's it that 
just leave it at that. Give him his fair opportunity. And I, I have full confidence that he's going to do well. And that's all. I'm leaving it at that. Awesome. Yeah. Awesome, awesome, awesome. But Jamaica, I'm not spending much more time here with you all. <laughs> um, I said, just came back. And, and I'm sure he's tired after that extensive travel uh, all day. And he has had a jam-packed week. But I said, I'm... You know I'm happy for you. I celebrate you publicly, and I say they never want Andrew. They never, they never want. I saw it go, man. But my my respects, um, people, people, Kesu, I see you. Um, yeah, so I have been traveling. It, I'm, I'm, a, I'm a bit tired now in any event, so um, I don't know if he's going to come back. But if not, I, I know that we have gone past the 10 o'clock time. Kimmy? Gimme, gimme, Kimmy. Yeah. Um, so bl blessings all. Um, I want to say good night to y'all as well. I don't know if he's going to... Let me see if he's going to um, rejoin. Mm -mm, still on, almost. What's the one? Oh, I don't have that. They don't need cleaning. believe vibes cartel one is appealed today does anyone have cartel's lawyer's number <laughs> it's the funniest thing you believe vibes you cartel one is appealed today does anyone have cartel's lawyer's number <laughs> yeah, this is the funniest thing is the funniest thing yeah it looked like them god man let me let me let me call him and see what's going on Yeah. Listen, that clone me out that I hear that time we play again, but it's, it's hilarious. Can you believe Vibes Cartel won his appeal today? Does anyone have Cartel's lawyer's number? <laughs> yeah, two o'clock Jamaica time. Uh, reasoning with Ratigan. So that's why I need to go to bed so I can be there. Listen, this thing is hilarious. Listen, you, any, you show in? So, what I must tell them? All right, cool, cool. I'll do that. All right, yeah. All right, so um, people, on behalf of Andre Stevenson, um, the the show has ended. Um, he's not returning, and um, I have reached my threshold as well. So, um, blessings, everybody. It was a very entertaining show. The comment, the students, as always, was lit. So we will see you guys. Well. Sunday for Andre, but definitely next week. I'll be here again next week, Friday. So big up on yourself. Um, he's not gonna sign off, so I'm gonna do that for him by ending um the stream. All right, so take care. I'm leaving the studio, so even if it's running, it's 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 finished. Night night, Semonish. Them exotic name there, Semonish. Little more. <laughs>